All right, so we're about to do the barbell conventional deadlift. It's a really good exercise for the hamstrings, which are located on the back of the leg, the core, the lats, biceps, and even the quads. So go ahead and get in the setup position at the bottom. You'll notice our feet are directly underneath the shoulders. Hands are directly on the outside of the shins. This is going to allow her to come straight up without her hands hitting her knees, which will make the bar path kind of wobbly, harder to control the movement. Chest is upright, neutral head. Her, she isn't over exaggerating that tilt in her neck, which would um, travel down her spine and cause her spine to be in an unneutral position. Put a lot of pressure on that lower back. All right, so come up. So you'll notice how she comes up. She's also squeezing the glutes in the back, which is going to engage that whole posterior chain, get a little bit more out of it for the glutes. Her shoulder blades are staying back. It's gonna prevent her from slumping forward at the top position and putting a lot of pressure on her rotator cuff. She's keeping her core tight, which is going to keep that back straight throughout the entire movement. So go ahead and go back down. You'll notice as she goes down, those hips are going back. She's not really leaning forward. Go ahead and come back up. She comes up, the hips are going forward, squeezing the glute, and go back down. Hips are coming back. She's keeping all that weight in her heels and the ball of her foot evenly distributed. That way she's kind of engaging these quads, these glutes, the core, and the lats. Shoulder blades are staying back to really engage the lats back here. Once again, with this movement, you're really trying to engage the lats, the biceps, the hamstrings, glutes, quads. If one of these muscle groups are lagging during this movement, you're more likely to injure yourself and you're also not going to be able to pull as much weight during the reps. Just think of it as your muscles are a team. You want them to work together to pull up. If one muscle group is lagging, the whole movement's gonna lag. Once again, hips are going back. Go ahead and lean forward. Kind of do it improperly a little bit. It's gonna put a lot more pressure on this lower back when that bar is further away. You want it to go straight down. You don't want that to happen. It's also going to make those shoulder blades come forward at the bottom. Just sitting back into the movement, just like that. And that's the barbell deadlift.